Hello everyone. I am going to pour on this um, glass plate and um, so it can be used. I'm going to pour on the back. Um, I have a dirty pour here, a cup, a um, jar anyhow, and I've got uh, red, phthalo blue, fluorescent pink, white and silver. So, I don't think I'm going to flip it. <laughs> I think I'm just going to pour it. Yeah. Yes, here we go. See what happens. Whoa. I'm wanting it to spill over. I missed a bit there. Because obviously what's under there is what's going to show. Hopefully. Come on, do your thing. to flow under uh, interesting to see what the other side looks like not going to be able to see it for a while oh, it looks rather nice on this side Remains to be seen what it looks like on the other side. There's a bubble. Silver. Wow, oh, that's pretty thick in there. That oh, got it. Don't know if it was necessary. Okay, I think it stopped. Maybe I will do a bit more of this because I guess if it, if the front's no good. Or the underside then I could use this side for something Okay, I'll come back when it's um, dry enough to move. Hello again. Uh, this is my finished plate. Um, and yeah, I'm really quite 
happy with it. Uh, just trying to see where I can get the best view of it. Uh, yeah, so it actually turned out pretty good. Uh, so this is my second attempt. I'm not sure where the first one is. Um, we, the first one's kind of turned out okay. And then I actually have done another one which didn't turn out quite as well as I would have liked. I really enjoy doing this pouring on um, glass. So that's it. If we can get a bit closer. Oh yeah, there we go. Getting better at this uh, zoomy stuff. So the back, um, I have uh, when I did this one, I filled that part in and um, it was, because there's a ridge here, it was really deep and the, naturally the outside dried first and I'd forgotten how deep this was. So I lifted it up and this all flowed everywhere and um, made a mess of that but it really doesn't matter because I'm wanting to have it as a usable plate um, or you know for decoration whatever I'm thinking of giving it to my son um, and so I have have coated the back two or three times with a satin varnish that I've had Oh gee, I've had this for so long. Folk art by plaid. Uh, it's just about finished, so I was just using that up. Um, I think I will actually do a a spray over the back, like a gloss spray or something, just so it can be wiped over. I think it probably could be now, but I think probably another couple of coats might be a good idea. Uh, so yeah, there it is. Really happy with that, and um, I'll be doing some more. So I got this plate from um, one of the dollar stores, and um, it was a dollar fifty. So it's pretty cheap, and yeah, I really enjoy doing it. Thanks for watching, everyone. Bye for now.